things. You have absolutely nothing to worry about. I mean, being with a prince like a prince, prince, one and only prince of Baka, do be one of a near king. I will make you happy for the rest of your life. Unless I'm much more better than that boyfriend of yours who would have been about. You see, um, <coughs> you just played your loyalty to me. And I will make all the women everywhere. Serious? I will take you around the world. Thank you, my friends. <laughs> Say that again. <laughs> I 
What is happening between you and Adam? Mama, I think I have lost Adam. With the kind of attitude Ada is putting these days, I think Adama is no more for me anymore. What do you mean by that? <sighs> now, so many things are really happening. So, so many things. Do you know Ada is now seeing one, uh, one prince, uh, Ubaka of one uh, 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 Aniri kingdom? One rascal prince is working, is he working like this? As if he's the owner of the whole world. I own Adama. Adama, Mama. No. But how come I've not noticed it? Am I cannot be lying about her now. She can do it. Okay. It's all about me. After everything I've done for her. I didn't notice anything. 
Adam, Ma, good afternoon. Adam, Ma, um, what is this uh, Stan is telling me about you? That what? That is like both of you are no longer together. What? Adam, Mama. So you want to encourage me to continue my relationship with this kind of a person? Eh? Huh? You are standing. You have no reason whatsoever to come and make any complaint here. If you truly value and respect our relationship, why do you find it so difficult to give me money each time I ask for it? Why? Mama, life with the prince is fun. Life with the prince is richer, full of money, wealth, fame, affluence, power. Do you know how much I bought that good for you? 250,000 naira. Have you ever won such jewelry before in your life? Can he buy it? He can't. Anyway, I don't want to tell you, but let me just tell you because you're my mother. Very soon, very, very soon, I'm going to be the next queen because the prince is going to get married. Adama. Uh, Adama. Ma, just look at yourself. Adama, life is not all about wealth. Oh, ah, shit. Life is all about money. Money can buy everything. Money can buy love. Money can buy a human. In fact, as I am now, the prince has already bought me with this money. And I'm madly in love with him. <sighs> Mama, did you hear that? Stanley, just yeah. sit, sit down. Don't sit down for sit, sit, Did you hear just what Adama just said? Don't listen to her. Sit down. Don't listen so to it's her. all about money now, right? How do you have to offer, Stanley? You are coming to report me to my mother. So it's all about did you buy any bag of rice, my mother? No problem. Stanley, Mama, come. Stanley, you can't even behave like a man. A real man. Look at you. Hey, 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 come. Stanley, you don't come. even have a jeep. You don't even have bodyguard. No problem. So my friend, go. I can't go. Like this. Yes, my prince has swagger. And I love him. Look at him. Get out from this place. I can't no go. Problem. I don't know. I don't know. Hey, because I don't know. What is it? You won't want to die in penury. Because I want to die. Hey, Stanley, look at this stupid human being. Empty, empty. Come on, come on. I want to talk with you. But there's no problem. There's no problem. But it's about the money you're spending on, this, on that girl and her family. Or have you forgotten that you have not paid her bride price? Is there any arrangement that you're making which I don't know? What about the girl spending? Emeka, the kind of money you're spending on that girl and her family, you have not spent it on me. And since you started getting that girl, you have been, you have been answering them at every minute. Or you think I don't know? Please give me the water. Mama. Mama. Who is feeding you with all this? Feeding me with what? Thank you. Are you the one feeding Mama with all this? Okay. Tell her I spend money on the neck and the family. Is it not true? Oh. When I've given you money for my upkeep, just look at my hair, brother. Mecca, just look at my hair. No new clothes, no new shoes. Will you shut up your mouth? Mecca, Mecca. Where do you even think money comes from? All the clothes I bought for you last month, are you done wearing them? Buy another one. Buy new ones, Mama. Mama, did you not give this girl money last week? Anyway, much as I know my duties in this house, Neka is still very much a responsibility. Neka that will marry her and bring her home. The all the money you are spending on her, will that counted for? How can you be giving everything you own to this family, to her, to the girl? What is it? Mm. Give me this thing, let's see. Give me excuses. Mm. Mm. Okay. Very soon, I'll marry Nick. I hope that settles it. Ah, marriage, that's what I want. And if I do that, do that very fast. That's how I'll start shouting again. Mama, what is talking about marriage? He will give you. Just be running your mouth there, let me get you. Your hair and your shoes, that's all you know. Give me water, let me drink. Sure. Look, what are you doing? Come on, 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 come on. You will make you give me money to make your hair and those things. You didn't give me any money to keep for you. Mm -hmm. You mean you bought all this for you? Yes, Mama. Mama, you're talking. That is how he is. Do you know anytime we step out, we might just go out now to buy maybe fill. Before I know it, he'll just take me into a shop, a boutique and buy me something. Either a bag, a shoe or something. Hey. That's the way he is. Hey! hey. You. Who hey. hey. you? Hey. Hey. What for Jimmy? Hey! This is what I like. Hey! <laughs> Uncle must live long. Amen. Amen. Nice person. Such a wonderful young man. He must continue to prosper in Jesus' name. Amen. Hmm. You're already singing all these phrases. If I show you this one, what will you do? Eh, okay, 
Okay. <laughs> hey! So I should give you this one. Jesus Christy. For me? Yes, and this is for Papa. I'll give him when he comes from Enugu. He said I should give you give that me one. Your fat no, give me your father. Give me, he's my husband. Give me, don't worry. Let me give you for you when he comes from Enugu. Don't, don't worry, I'll give it to me. Okay, take. Hey! Eh? You mean the maker gave us this? Yes. Hey! Such a wonderful young man. <laughs> he has not married you and he's doing all these ones. Who has paid your bride price in court? <laughs> hey! Uh, Emeka! Mopogi Mamma, Onye Ganyem! Ewa! Mopogi Mogga, Onye Ganyem! I'm going to put you in here. Amy Bobo, smoke all my. How? Nice man. Any death that will kill Emeka, let that death come and kill my hey, Mama, nothing is happening to anybody. Come and kill me. Nobody that died. young man will not die. Amen. He must live and continue to prosper. Amen. Hey! Hey! I will give you. My prince, I want to ask you something. Yes, son. Go ahead and talk. When are you going to introduce me to the queen as a future wife? At least, introduce me as the future queen. I'll tell you. I mean, I'll tell you tell me what to do and when to do it. Huh? If I'd wanted to introduce you to my mom, I would have done that and not you giving me orders. Nobody gives me orders. Yeah. Why are you talking like this? You ain't the one that told me you were going to introduce me to the queen? What have I done wrong? Oh, everything wrong. Everything wrong, girl. Everything wrong, yes. Yes. Wrong. Seeing you right now irritates me. Yes. Get that. You know what? This very minute, I want you to leave my palace. Do you think you can just use and dump me? Huh? Uh, okay, my friends, just be calm. Oh, you calm down, you calm down. You know I'm a very temperamental personality. Leave this moment or I'll do something very nasty. You know what I can do. My friends, you can't can just talk like that. Get out of my sight! Adama! Adama, leave my sight right now. I don't want to see you. Close to me anymore. Maybe some other time. Get out! Get out of the matter and see you. Get out! Bitch, you're sick. You're sick, get out! Bitch! Guys! Where are you? Get out of my pants! Eat it! Eat it! Bitch! Get out! Maybe she wants to serve us food. Uh, food every time. <laughs> uh, hey, I'm just thinking of when both of you will be joined as husband and wife. Uh, I'm also thinking of the fair line, you see. I, I always dream of the day I see my daughter wearing a wedding. Hey, Mama, hmm? Papa, yeah. see what you guys are thinking about. Yes. Mama, don't worry, yeah. I'm working towards that, seriously. I'll be traveling very soon. When I get back, um, we'll talk about it. Moreover, I don't want to distract Neka's education. You know, she's in her finals now, and then she'll be writing exams soon. Let's just give her time to run her. All that to be taken care of. Okay, oh, <laughs> you said so, my in law. <laughs> just that, I can't wait to see both of you, you married, die together. You will, okay? Mama, Mama, so, Mama, I'm waiting for that day. In fact, I'll be the best man. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. My guy, mm. don't worry, you'll be the best man. Yes. <laughs> I tell you, I'll get you an expensive suit. Oh, thank you. <laughs> my son, Papa, in whatever thing you do, you have my blessing. Thank you, sir. You will prosper beyond your imagination. <laughs> yeah. More than your imagination. More than you can think of. 
to have you in our family. Your enemies will forever be at your back and you continue to be ahead of them. Amen. Lunch is ready. Let's all go and do it. My money for you. I made it for you. My love. Dad, yes. Open the gate. I want to see the prince. Sorry, madam. The prince is busy. Can't see the prince now. What? Madam, the prince is busy. Don't you know me? Hey. I found open the gate. I want to see the prince. I found open this gate. Talk of the devil. Let her in. Open the gate. Now. Uh -huh. oh. Take it easy. That's even great. Please, you need to sack this guard. They just humiliated me at the gate. Now listen and listen, real girl. Haven't I warned you not to ever step your feet into this company anymore? Haven't I? My prince, what have I done now? Eh? What have I done? Listen. Get out of my sight, or else I order the guards to throw you out. I'm sorry, please. Please just forgive me if I've done anything wrong. Oh, please, I'm on. sorry, my prince. What are you still waiting for? Guards! Yes, yes, my prince. prince. Guards! Yes, my prince. What are you waiting for? Stand outside. Do your job. Just forgive me. Stop! Outside, please. Out. Get out of my sight. Guards! My prince! Take my prince, you can't do this to me. Out. Leave my hand. Look at this stupid guy. Look at this one down there. My prince! My prince, what is it? Mom. Why, why, why did you throw her out like that? Mom, don't mind that common now. Don't mind that dirty bitch who stands with low class. Yeah, she irritates me, you know. I mean, I detest such girl with such personalities. Yes, I don't want her around me anymore. I give him my time, my body, my soul, my love, everything. Is she not the same girl I saw with you the other day your musician was playing? Mom, don't mind her. Let's not talk about this girl. She's past tense. No. You know how these things go. Every girl wants to associate with royalties. You know me, you know my personality. Ubaka. Mom, come on. I thought you know better than this. Don't worry. I'll get you a better girl this time that will give you the grandchildren that you've always wanted. Trust me. I'm capable. You know what I'm capable of doing. Yes. Mom? Mom? Change the topic. Change the topic, Mom. Oh, God. I left Stanley for the prince, and this is all I've got to do. So what is all this? Oh God, where do I go from here? Oh God, no man has ever embarrassed me like this, oh no man. Good day, Your Majesty. The Queen of this great kingdom. <laughs> so I'd like to talk to you. So what's it all about now? I am no longer comfortable with your marital status. Oh, mom, oh, mom, oh, mom. Mom, I told you I'll get married at the appointed time. I mean, where the time comes for me to get married, I will. Come on, let's drop this topic. No, we are not going to drop it this time. 
Remember you are the prince. The heir apparent to the throne of this great kingdom. I'm aware of that, Mom. I'm aware of that. Just that I've not seen the right girl to get married to. <laughs> Obaka, in this whole kingdom, come on, you've been overseas and back, yet you're telling me you've not been able to get a girl you want to marry. Mom, you know you've always wanted the best for me in life. You've always wanted me to associate myself with the greatest, even those that are greater than I am. You've always wanted the high class and not the low class for me. Yes, no. The truth is that I've not seen any girl that defeats my status as a prince that I am. What about the girl you drove away the other day? I, I hope it is not because of this new one that you drove that one away. Oh, you're talking about Adama. Mom, the new one in question right here is much more better than Adama. Adama is a wasted property, yes. She's a wasted property. Trust me. Mom, the new one is the right one for me. Indeed. Oh, Mom, you've come again for once, Mom. Believe me, once. Mom, don't worry. Don't worry. I'll make you proud amongst women, trust me. Trust me. since yesterday. Papa, the prince has rejected me. Me, Adama. The prince says I'm no more value to him. Simply because I asked him to introduce me to the queen. What was my crime? What? Just like that. Just like that. How can he just dump you just like that? Huh? But Adama, remember, I warned you. Listen to me, I'm talking to you. Remember I told you that money is not everything. But you said that money can buy love. Look at yourself. Just look at what you have brought upon yourself. Mm -hmm. Because I warned you. Mama. Mama what? Is that what you are saying? Is that what you are saying? Look at me. My hand is not there. Whatever thing you think you will do to retain your relationship, that is your business. Are you listening to me? Mm -hmm. Because I warned you. Mama. Mama what? Is that what you are saying? Money. <laughs> Love can buy money. God! Is that what you are saying? Eh? When you are busy eating the money, you think of money. Money can buy everything. Look at you, stay there. I want you. Is that what you are saying? Hey! God! <laughs> if, if the prince had gotten married to me, we would you be bad when I married to the king? <laughs> God, what am I going to deserve all this from the prince? Oh. Hey! I can't go back to Stanley. <laughs> Me. I know I've offended you, but just find a place in your house to forgive me. I'm very sorry. Please. Please. It wasn't intentional. Yeah, you're correct. It was never intentional. You know what? The little brat prince deceived you with his wealth. Ada, what did I not do to make you happy? I gave you my love. I gave you all the attention you needed. I treated you like a lady. I made you feel like a woman. I was there for you every time you needed. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, please. Do you know the pains I went through? Do you? I don't have anything against you anymore. I've forgiven you since, since, since. Are you serious? Forgiving you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. 
something. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah? What the hell is going on? Nothing. Is anything happening? Stella, you! With my man? What? Your man? <laughs> Can you imagine that? Huh? <laughs> oh God. Listen to me. Can you see the pretty lady beside me? She's gonna be my wife three weeks from now. No! No, no mommy, no, you can't say that. You can't! You know what? We're gonna send the wedding card. Oh, stop it! You're highly welcome. <laughs> Baby. Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! God! Stop it! <laughs> Gosh, look at that. My man. Me. Why won't I be troubled? Now tell me. Why won't I be troubled when that girl ignored my identity? Tell me, James, why won't I? Girl. Okay. <laughs> Wait, but my prince, you don't have anything to do with the girl now. Shut up your stinking mouth. How many times have I warned you to mind the way you speak to your crown prince? Huh? Um, I'm sorry, my prince. You better be. James. My prince. Do you know where that guest is? Um, yes. Um, I usually see her around them, Amanda Street. Good. James, I want a dose here. I want every useful information about that girl. I want you to get me every information about the girl. Where she stays, how she sleeps, every useful information, I don't care. Just do that for me. Even the air that she breathes, get it, fish it out. You can now leave. <laughs>
Yes, sir. Yes, what? What is it this time? The prince came to steal me. Chase women around and lavish money on them. He just goes using women and dumping them. Is that the kind of life he wants to live? Well, that's for the girls that allow him to use them and dump them. As for me, I don't have that time, so you won't even have a chance to do that. Besides, I have you, and I'm not searching. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Let me see. That's why I don't do this food. I love you on that time. Good day, sir. You are a point of correction, little boy. I'd rather you address me as a prince. Good day, my prince. Mm. So, is anybody at home? Yes. Good afternoon, young man. I'm sorry, the prince. Prince, you're welcome to our home. This one, you people are looking for us. I hope there's no problem. Yeah, madam, I'm afraid everything is under control. Uh, just that uh, a couple of days back, I bumped into one chocolate complexion beautiful girl who walked into this compound. So I now thought it wise to come over and see her, and um, I guess she's your daughter. You mean Neka? Now you're talking. Yes, she's my daughter. Is there anything the matter? Uh, not at all, not at all. I just want to see her for some privacy. Well, she's not at home. She has gone back to school. Hmm. So, <clears throat> what school does she attend? Prince, this one that somebody like you is coming to look for my daughter. I, I hope everything is alright. Like I rightly told you from the onset, everything is alright. Anyway, um, she attends Maloney University. Hmm. Maloney. Mandoni University. All right, all right. So, uh, <clears throat> how do I get to see her when I get to the school? Look for her at the English department. She studies English. Take note. Okay. Very well then. Um, that's all for now. I'll take my leave. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, I don't trust that man. No. Didn't you see how he was roving his eye like a criminal? Shut up. Didn't you see he's a prince? Eh? Do you know why he's looking for your sister? Go inside and wash the plates in the kitchen. Go and wash those plates. Let me come and cook.
Hello, pretty. Yeah. I know you'll be shocked and surprised to see me hostel. Well, I was about asking you that. How did you find my hostel? Or did you come here to see somebody else? Well, <clears throat> you see, I I discovered true treasure in you. Yes. Well, as a matter of fact, from the very onset, I I set my eyes on you. I just can't get you out of my mind. Yes. You know what, baby? I am falling for you. Um, listen, all right? I will not say this again after now. I am taken. I am in a relationship. Please, stay away from me. Thank you. Excuse me. I am talking to you and you're working with me. Huh? Don't you realize we always talking to you? Prince Obak at the Ubili one of a new kingdom. Don't worry, sooner than you think I'll make you realize how much I love you. James! My prince. James! My prince. How do you see that girl? Man, my prince, that gets very beautiful. You oh. see her sheep. Oh, really? Yes. Yeah. You have more work to do on that, man. What did I say? You have work to do. Yeah. James! My friend. You know, don't tell me you have a new girlfriend in school. <laughs> Not even that. So what is it then? Uncle Emeka bought me all these things. I've been meaning to ask you. This is beautiful. I like it. <laughs> I know you like it. <laughs> See, eh? Uncle Emeka is really trying for my family. I wish I had a girlfriend that spends on me the way Uncle Emeka spends on my sister. <laughs> Funny guy. Please, can you lend me this as well? <laughs> Which is not possible. See, I advise you. Let your sister go and marry a wealthy man that will always buy you these things. Wicked boy. I know I'll be wicked, but I'm not giving it to you. Before you use your eye to fall this thing. Come on, let's go, Jaren. Babel. Like you. I, I don't know. Seriously. This is so confusing. I don't know what that prince wants from me. You know, he keeps following me everywhere. He practically stalks me. Do you know that he even came to my school? What? He came to your school? Yes! For what? I don't know, I don't know. What does he really want from me? Because he can get any girl he wants, if he wants a girlfriend. I've told him that I am taking, I am not available, but he doesn't want to listen. I think that guy wants us to have a clash. And I sure will give it to him. <sighs> Why does he follow you around? What's his problem? I don't know. I don't know. Seriously. I don't blame him. I blame his father for bringing him up in such an irresponsible and uncultured manner. You're right, though. Because that guy is not cultured. If he is, he would have just respected my decisions and move on. I wonder. Is it by force? But he doesn't even want to know. He doesn't even want to listen to me. I don't get it. It's becoming scary. What, what does he want? See that? I don't want you to worry yourself about this, okay? Leave it to me, I'll handle it. Just trust me. Okay? Daniel. Yes. You know, my greatest worry now is the prince. Is it about your fiance? Yes. Do you know this guy went to her school to visit her? What? I'm telling you the truth. You mean he has gone that far? Jesus Christ, this is serious, honestly. See, Emeka, um, you have to act fast now. Because if you don't, uh, you may end up losing that you are almighty Neka. I am actually not worried about Neka, okay? It's the way he's going about this whole thing that pisses me off. I, I trust Neka. I know she cannot fall for his antics. Well, we are not talking about trust here, my brother. 
what we're talking about here is who gets what. Honestly. Act fast. That's just my take on that. Of all the girls around, why would he particularly go for my own woman? Well, what is wrong with that guy? Why wouldn't he? And like, let's look at it this way. A girl has all it takes. She's pretty, she's responsible, and most importantly, she's single. I mean, every genuine young man would die for her. So I don't blame uh, the prince. You understand that? To be sincere, I were you, I would have just quickly go meet her parents, then make some form of payment, call it dowry. By so doing, you would have, you know, cemented the relationship permanently. Hmm. That's my take. Yeah, I think you have a point. Papa. Papa, I don't know what is wrong with that, that stupid and foolish prince or whatever they call him. I don't know what he's thinking, you know. Eka, go and bring that stuff first. Come here. What has he done to marry such strong uh, and uh, insulting language from you? Ah, uh ah, -uh, Papa. Every time he'll be pestering me, following me up and down, calling me. I've told him to leave me alone. I'm in love with somebody else. He doesn't want to listen. Is love by force? Is it by force? It's okay. not by force. It's not by force. But don't worry, my dear. Don't worry. As long as I'm alive, there's nothing anybody can do to change the love you have for Emeka. Okay? Papa, you see why I love you? Oh, and I love you also, my dear. Are you hungry? Yeah, I think so. Okay. I want to make a batch for you. Will you eat? Yeah, why not? That type we made the other time. We know garden yeah, egg. Don't worry. Just yeah. give me ten minutes. Okay, I'll my love. It for you. It's a blessing. Thank you. Hmm. <laughs> give your love. Mama, anyway, seriously, I don't know what that prince wants from me. Because the truth of the matter is that I will never ever leave Emeka for another man. So he's just wasting his time. Don't mind him. Don't mind him. Eh? Where was he all this time that Emeka has been taking care of all of us in this family? My dear, nothing will ever come between you and Emeka. As a matter of fact, we have to intensify our prayers so that God will continue to prosper that young man. God has been using him for us in this house. Mama, it's not news that this prince is a place. Everybody knows it. He uses and dumps girls at will. Is you Yes. Hey! Please, let him go. Don't need him. Well, there he, he is. Work out. What has he come to do? Hey, talk of the devil and their peers. Hello? Prince! Good day, madam. Ah, good day, you're welcome. I mean, why is she walking away from me like that? Um, Prince, I need to explain certain things to you. You see, Prince, my daughter is in love with someone else. They've been together for years. And this young man has been taking very good care of her. Even we are parents. Emeka ah, has been such a wonderful person to us in this house. And my daughter is so committed and dedicated to him. So I don't think this relationship that you're asking for my daughter is going to work out. As a matter of fact, they are even planning to get married. So, I will advise that you try someone else. Well, madam, you see, uh, <clears throat> I realize from all indication you don't know who you're talking to. I don't think you have any single idea who I am. I don't think she knows. I don't think so. But with time, she will know you. Yeah. You see, madam, I want to take care of you. Take care of your daughter. 
and all the responsibilities which he that calls himself a lover man has never done to you. Yes. Uh, you see, um, madam, if you permit me, I want to make your daughter the queen of my kingdom. Ah, Prince, there's no need for all that. We are content the way we are. I mean, my daughter is okay. Hmm? No need for all that, okay? Don't worry, get another good woman to marry. Hmm? You see, madam, I appreciate the fact that you remembered what that man has done for you in the past. You see, um, um, not all women out there will do what you're doing right now. A whole lot of women out there will probably be carried away by one's wealth and royalties. But in your own case, you're different. Thank you. All right, um, I love your daughter so much. Please, I wish you all the best, then, because it will work out. Come out to be a god. I was saying, this matter is getting out of hand. The prince is doing all his best to destroy the happiness of this lovely family. Who? God forbid. He will not succeed. But, Papa, what does he want from us? I don't know. This is a man that uses girls and dumps them anyhow. Plays with girls' emotions. What does he want from me? Now he wants to come to Neka. God forbid. Okay. No wonder he was looking like a criminal that day. That didn't you see the way he was roving his eye that day? Hmm. To me, Emeka is the man. Oh. Yes. You can see the things that he buys for me. Emeka is trying. Come to think of what Emeka has done for this family. Eh? You'll find out that he deserves her love. Yes. He deserves her love. Very much so. He and does. Can't fail him. He has proven to be a true son of this family. Eh? Is he not? Very much so. He deserves, he deserves our love. No, we cannot disappoint him. Yes, okay. never. Papa, mm -hmm. that prince doesn't look like a gentleman at all. Though. Oh. Anybody that plans to come between Neka and Emeka, that person will not live. He must die, even if he's a so-called prince. Amen. Mama, a big amen. Emeka has been picking the bills from this house. He has paid their fees. He has paid their own. Has he not tried? I wonder. He has tried. Very well. You see? He has done even more than what his son can do for his family. He wants to come and reap where he did not sow. Where was he when Emeka was picking the bills of uh, neck and all of us in this house? He better go and pack his clothes where he hung it though. He cannot walk. You see? 
So, whether I'm alive or dead, I don't want to see a maker disappointed. Bam, Papa, you don't even need to say it. Nobody can make me leave a mecca. Yes. It's not possible. Uh -huh. A mecca is like my life. Mm -hmm. We are even inseparable. Anybody can try, but they will never succeed. Very it's good. Not possible. Boy. Very good. Boy. Yeah, my daughter. Prince, yeah. Prince, you're welcome. Madam, how are you doing? I'm fine. Uh, welcome, madam. <coughs> welcome, eh? <coughs> so, madam, regards to what I told you the last time, have you putting that under consideration? <coughs> uh, Prince, I, I have thought of everything. It's not going to be possible. You see, my daughter is already involved with someone else. And they're so into each other. She's very much in love with him. That young man has been so wonderful to us in this family. And all of us, in fact, eh, the guy is even marrying all of us. He has our support, so it cannot work out. So, uh, <clears throat> if I may ask, uh, what does this man have that can do in 100 folds, million folds, or billion folds? Name it. You see, madam, it's my duty to take very good care of you and your daughter. Yes. I want to make sure you all are happy for the rest of your life. Um, <clears throat> um, concerning her education and every other thing she needs in life, you leave that to me, I'll take care of that. And I always make sure she goes to school with exclusive cars that I have in abundance. Prince, you have spoken well. You're a very handsome young man. Yeah, I've been told about that many times. I remember vividly when I met um, the Queen of England in Buckingham Palace. She also told me that. Even Amanda, the Princess of Damascus, the other time we met in Paris, she also complimented me. She said same. So I'm not surprised about that. Of course, you're a very handsome young man. And you're quite rich. Yeah, I know you're tripping. Go ahead. You're every young girl's dream as a husband. And any mother would gladly want to have you as a son-in-law. Oh, you see, my dear, our hands are tied. Emeka has been so wonderful to all of us in this house. My daughter is very much in love with him. So uh, I, I will advise that maybe you try some other person. I'm sure they will gladly want to you know, marry you. My daughter is not, she's not available. Uh, <clears throat> Madam, I'll have you, okay? Think about the financial aspect of it. Think about what you tend to gain from me being the prince right here, because I have everything, everything in it, everything in, in abundance, all right? You see, uh, <clears throat> This talk about, um, what's his name again? I don't care to know, Emeka or whatever, I don't know. You talk about him doing this, doing that and all that. What has he done so far? No, Emeka has been so wonderful. I've not seen a man like that. Hang on a minute, he has done so much for us. Hang on a minute. He has done this yet you still stay under this swamp you call a house? You stay under this roof you call, oh my God, I can't imagine my own princess stay under this roof. No, I can't imagine that now. I can't imagine. You see, this is what's going to happen now. <clears throat> Henceforth, I want you to do everything with your ass now and make sure everything works out positively. And you leave the rest to me. Because um, I will just get you out of this roof and take you down straight to GRA. And you own a house. You get a house of your own. I promise you that. Yes. And come to think of it, what are you having in your hand? Uh, pure water. Come on, come on, come on, come on. That's poison you're taking. I can't imagine. Oh my God. Oh, James. Take it out of her. Take it out of her. <laughs> you see, that is why you have me. Yes. You have a maker yet to drink pure water. Or was it called? But with me, 
James, do not forget when we get home, let's put that on budget so we can have them import all the spring water. You see, with spring water, it gets you refreshed. What, with something like this, you call them, what's that name again? Uh, you, you just die soon. Yes. So think about what I just told you, okay? So excuse me. Um, yes, that's why I'm here. Oh, okay. So, what can I do for you? Um, actually, the prince asked me to deliver a check of five million naira and uh, this box of drapes. Okay, the check has already been filled. All you need to do is just to fill out the name and go cash the check. Here. Listen, alright? I do not need these gifts. I don't want them. I'm in a very serious relationship and I do not want distractions from you, from the print or from anybody. I mean, this is a check of five million naira. This gift is worth more than a million naira. You're rejecting it. Excuse me. personal guard to embarrass me. First, it was the prince himself. Now his personal guard. Mm -hmm. What is wrong with that guy? He sent his guard to give me a check of five million naira and a box of gifts. I didn't even care to open what open the gifts and see what was in it. I don't even want to know. Five? And you accepted it? I accepted it? How can you even ask that kind of question? How will I accept such a great gift? Of course I did not accept it. This is getting out of hand. This has really taken a new direction. I think it's high time I did something about it. I don't know what you want. Seriously. That. I just want you to know that I will always be there for you. Just disregard the look. Yeah, how you doing? I'm fine. Welcome. Yeah, 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 thank you. I hope all is well. Yeah, I, I, there's no cause for alarm. I, I came in peace. Peace be unto you. Peace unto you too. Yes, yes. sir. Madam, what's going on? Uh, everywhere is so scanty. It's so, so scanty. I mean, come on. Uh, by the way, where is your daughter? Oh, she has gone back to school. Oh, really? Yeah, you see, madam, I'm here to, um, I'm here to take you to somewhere private. I want to show you a big surprise. Surprise? Yes. I don't understand. I can't have my one and only sweet sensational mother-in-law. Pet trading. Now, never again. You see, I, I, I want to surprise you. It might interest you that I have a very big surprise when you come over with me. Yes. Madam, My face. you don't need to walk anymore. 
you don't need to come to this thing you call shop. All you need to do is sit at home and money will be flowing like fountain. All right? <laughs> like how? What the prince is trying to say is that um, you just sit at home and money will come to you. Just like that. You pay me salary? Yes. It's the prince. Absolutely. You see, that's what I want to do. I want to make you proud. I want the whole community to be proud of you. I want your friends, the whole neighborhood, to be proud of you. You understand what I'm saying? So I'm here to take you down. Just get prepared and let's get going. And as for it, I will be paying you salary every month and you will be paid handsomely well. <laughs> oh, madam, I can see you don't realize who is standing right in front of you. I am the only prince, Prince Obaka, the only one of American kingdom. Oh, madam, you need to taste a little of my fortune, a little of my wealth, and you will never remain the same again. James! James! Come on, let's get going, boy. Madam, get prepared and let's go. Okay, I'm coming. Okay, I'm Um, neighbor, Amadi, Amadi, please come. Um, Amadi, just keep an eye on my stuff. Okay, no I won't be long, eh? Okay, no problem. Thank you. Okay, yeah. bye -bye. Okay. So I can go back to the shop. <clears throat> you see, Mother, okay, no problem. You see, you don't have to bother about that thing you call the shop. You don't have to. I will acquire a big shopping mall for you, and you will be running a beauty and a supermarket at the same time. How do you say that? Prince, I would love to. I have all that. But the problem is that my daughter is already involved with someone. They are deeply in love with each other. It will not be possible. Yes, For I real, know. it will be possible. Yes, I know, madam. Yes, I know. But looking at the fact, ma'am, you're not a member of the royal family. Yes. You don't have to return back to that thing you call the store or shop or whatever. I don't want to peep you. I want to make you test the other side of life. You see, I'll be paying salary. I'll pay salary every month like I told you before. All you need to do is um, sit at home, sit under the air condition, and get refreshed every day. <laughs> Your offer is very tempting. It's very, very tempting, but I don't know. I, do people say, no, I cannot disappoint Emeka. It will be unheard of. I, I don't understand where I am coming from. 
You to be, you to be on head of no, 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 I can't do that. Oh, come on. Forget about what people will say. Forget people. Talk is cheap like they say. Yes, it's life for you. You see, madam, listen. If you're driving in your SUV, when will you have time to start listening to gossip? Then you'll be upgraded. You now move on and wear the high class. You see, think about your old son junior school abroad in the United States. You start rubbing sugar. But I guess women are well respected in the society. Think about it, man. James, I pray. What do you have to say about this? I pray you have a point. I don't think about it. is right in what he's saying. So, I will become the mother-in-law to the prince. No. No. Mban. Ah, that would not be possible. I cannot disappoint Emeka. That boy has tried so much for us in this family. But, but Emeka can still marry another person. Yes, you can still marry another person. Oh, God, I'm confused. Ah, I am just confused. What do I do? What do I do? Everything I do, I do them for you, my love. 